Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. Call me like a cherry pony. Call me like a cherry pony. Your boy done switched up on you. Call me like a cherry pony. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys look, if this is your very first time on this channel, run on and subscribe for me. After you subscribe, make sure you hit that notification bell. Beside the word subscribe, so that you will be notified each and every time that we upload a video. And then welcome to this great, 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 great family. Now that you're a part of there's some things that we do. And we do them every day to help us grow. Those things are comment, comment, comment like a share and go for the team. Come in like a share and come to the team. Come in like a share and don't forget to come in like a share. Come in like a share. Come in like a share. Don't forget to come in like a share. Come in like a share. Come in like a share. Don't forget to don't get to come in like a share. Okay, got checks out. We're gonna pray. We're gonna get into the goodness. Here we go. Hey man, how y'all doing today? How y'all doing today? How y'all doing today? You guys, we got our lips hot sauce. Uh huh. We got that. And if you like your bottle, wear up top screw dragon blue. Hit that link in right there. You can get your lips hot sauce. Amber. All right. Also, hit the side. We got Big Ben is in the building, baby. Big Ben is here. Big Ben is help us out because, baby, we been to get to eat. Let's see if he's nice refreshing. He is, okay guys, today, Big Ben has our Sun Kids Zero Sugar in him today. We also got some Sriracha over here to the side, some Sriracha. We got that over here too. Not today for the food, y'all, hey, glory. Hey, I need some, uh, I need some, uh, uh lemon pepper though, baby. You guys today for the food. Baby, we have got us a lemon pepper rotisserie chicken, and we have got us some bacon wrapped uh, jalapenos. They've got cream cheese in the inside. I'm not a big, big lover of cream cheese, but I have had these made for me before uh, by Heavy Duty Express. I've had them a couple of times, and they are good, so we're going to go ahead and give it a try again today, okay? Now, let's get to eating, because we done already prayed. Let's get it. Okay. Let me get this chicken over here, y'all. Oh, look at that. I lost my pepper already. Presentation already gone. Be very, very sad. I need that pepper. I think I'm. I thought I'm. I think I may be finna eat him. I gotta get this chicken undone here. I got it wrapped up here like it's running away from Alcatraz or something. Oh, come on off here. Mmm, mmm, crunchy. Y'all know the rotisserie chicken. When you get them home, you have to go back and uh, um, bake them a little more. Well, at least that's what I do anyhow. I put them bad boys back in the oven, honey. I do, I do, I do. Now, there we go. We got the lemon pepper. They also be needing extra lemon pepper on them too, honey. So I'll put you some extra lemon pepper up there on them because they're going to be them for me a little bit down here too. I'm feeling a little ranchy, a little ranchy. I don't know, y'all. I don't know what I want. Anyway, here is the bacon wrap jalapeno. Mmm. 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 See, they have cream cheese on the inside. Mmm. 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 They good. Mmm. <laughs> I'm just really not like a big fan of cream cheese. Mmm. 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 I'm just not a big fan of that. Mm. But this is good. It is. Mm-hmm. Let me get us some bird him. Mm. Let me get us some bird him. You see? Let me get us some bird him. You see? Mm-hmm. You see, honey? Yes, you do. You see? Mm. Ugh. Boom. There you go. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Hey, 
glory. Mmm. 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 Come here, bird. Mmm. -hmm. I wanted this sriracha today, y'all. On this good bird here. If you eat sriracha, there you go. If you eat it. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Mmm. Mmm. Bye bye. Mmm. 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 Today has been a good day. It's been a good day. Um, in a way, it's kind of somber day as well. Um, um, as you guys know, my father passed away some many years ago. Well, not many years ago, but in 2016. And we never, we never got around to putting the headstone up, y'all. And so we finally had a talk here lately. There you a good piece with the swatch on it. And uh mm, 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 mm. I realized that even though we know he gone, you know, because we lost me, my sister, and my brother, we lost both our both of our parents in six months. Back to back. And um mm, 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 mm. Come on out of there. I don't care nothing about that cream cheese you probably not there, but give my bacon. Mm, well, well. So um we realized that a part of the reason was that really makes it final. It's final already now. We understand that. But it kind of Leaves one thing unfinished, you know, that has to be done. Um, a reason for you know having to visit, you know, that's just one more reason that you have to go out there to visit, um, or whatever. Because it was strange for me. I can't go. Like, I can't go, y'all. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So, to place this headstone, it's a reason for me to go. Mm -hmm. But, anyhow, we're going to move on from that. Because I'm not in a sad, somber mood. It just was a little somberness to the day. Because we did get that done and finalized. And, you know. Or, you know. Got everything designed and everything. And all that kind of stuff. To get it. Mmm. 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 Place there. So anyway. What's up, Legion? What's up? Do not forget, our real Facebook page is Lips Legion. L L I P S L E G I O N. Some of y'all say I talk too fast and y'all can't understand what I be saying, so I'll put it on the screen. Mm -hmm. Thank you guys so much for your support over there. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. It's getting good. Y'all. Mm. I love rotisserie chickens. I used to love them from Walmart and Publix. And sometimes in the international market, you know, they have okay chickens. But hey, mm. you ain't gonna get a bigger, plumper, juicier, mm. suck you lot chicken. Then you're gonna get a Sam's. 
Baby, you gonna get you a big old sucky lot chicken that's found, baby. Mm-hmm. 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 Yes, sir. We were gonna buy a chicken yesterday. And um what was we at? International Rock, I think. Mm. Mm. But I knew we had to go to Sam today. Uh-uh. 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 Mm. I'm gonna wait and get my bird at Sam's tomorrow. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Yep. I got my bird too. Mm. Mm. I was gonna get some ribs. Mm. Because you know they have good ribs. I just don't want the barbecue sauce they put on. So I know I'm just get the uh, you one without barbecue. But they have any of those. All the ones they had today, I all had barbecue sauce on. Um, mm -hmm. Yes, indeed. Mm, mm, mm. Mm -hmm. So, y'all, how y'all doing? How y'all doing? We ain't gonna talk about this today, cause we don't talk about it two days in a row. Mm, mm. But I did find out, y'all, that yesterday I said that Chris Rock and Will Smith had both publicly apologized. Well, Chris Rock's publicist has let the world know that Chris Rock has not apologized. He said he was not ready to have any comment at this moment. And that what you see out there circulating is fake. You know what? Let me tell y'all something. Why come folks in the world won't mind their business? I don't get that. I do not get why people have so much, such a hard time minding their business. I don't get that. I don't. Mm. That's the craziest thing in the world for somebody to be done done. So y'all trying to get this gristle. I just back right here. Um But what pleasure, what good could anybody get from putting out a fake apology from Chris Rock? Ain't none they business! Oh. Folks is crazy. <laughs> Y'all ain't talking about your trying to laugh. Folks is crazy though. What could they possibly get out of putting out a fake apology from Chris Rock? You know what I'm saying? But I will say you this. They hit. They say his shows. He's coming here to Atlanta. His shows are selling out. A whole lot of stuff that he's involved with is selling out at this moment. I'm just saying. But anyway, we go look up the new information out there about that because I'm tired of talking about it now, honey. We done talked about it two days in a row, baby. Will or Chris Rock. I need the one of them stay me. Okay. So, I'm going to get back over here in my beat. Okay. But it was exciting. <laughs> mm hmm. 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 So y'all, spring is here. Spring is here. And so is the pollen. Oh! Y'all, why? Why? Mm. Literally, y'all. 
You have to wash your vehicle every day. Mm hmm. Now, if you plan on, if you plan on driving around in a shiny vehicle, you're going to have to wash that junk every day. Now, after you wash that junk every day, when you wake up in the morning, that junk will be right back with powder all over it. It is. So, if you plan on riding around in a nice, shiny vehicle, you sure are gonna do it the day that you wash it. And you ain't gonna get but a couple hours out of that. Because yesterday we went and washed our vehicle and drove across town, went in a store, the international market I was telling you about, I was gonna buy the chicken in, went in the store. Oh, that's a, did I get out? I'm sorry, went in the store, y'all. Bought that chicken like I told you I was gonna buy. Well, I, when I tell you I was gonna buy that chicken. We was in there maybe 45 minutes and came back out to wood. A truck already glazed from front to back with powder. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then when you go to sleep at night, wake up in this day and go outside, there is pollen all over your vehicle and it's thick. Like you need a, um, not a duster brush, like a feather. You need like one of them little scoop, the poop scooper brushes. You know, them little harder brushes. If you're going to try to scoop it off, it'd be so much, it'd be so thick, y'all. Oh. So, I know y'all is saying, well, lips. If you watch your truck every day anyway. But does it matter? It matters. Oh. It make your sciences so tight and whatever, whatever, whatever. If you have a science problem, you know what I mean. No. Uh, then you already then you gotta wear a mask. So not only are you congested, you itching, you got all this going on up here because of all this pollen. But then after that, then you gotta put a mask on your face. Oh. And we've been going out just about every day. Oh, I need to sit down somewhere. Y'all know about that chicken. Get you some of that cheek and y'all put that, that extra uh, lemon pepper on them. Mm -mm -mm. That be making it bussin', bussin', bussin'. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I just want to sit down at the house. And we got to go out again tomorrow. Oh. And Friday. Oh. But the weekend. Mm-hmm. My family better get ready to be well, well acquainted with the house. And don't open up the doors for too long either. <laughs> Not for real, y'all. Mm. For real. That power be too much. It be too much. And then on top of it being too much, it's everywhere. Like it's just everywhere. Everybody feels, because every year when this happens, I said every year, ooh, that, that person right there just trifling. Ooh, that person, I know they just trifling. Because, y'all, I seen a car last year. If I had been police, I would have stopped that car and gave him a ticket. It was so much pot, it was so much pot and built up on that vehicle. Mm. Even though the windows, you could tell now from looking at the windows, that you could still see out of them, because they weren't just like taped and totally covered. But, you could tell that they had to use the windshield wipers, you know, to move all the pollen. Oh, if I had been police, I would stop that car for real. It was so much pollen just built up on the car when they were going down the road, it was just throwing like pollen off of it. Like, I'm not talking about like, I mean, like pollen. Oh, I saw it last year myself, it was a mess. Too much. I see who that person that tried. I didn't know what that person's situation was. That car may ain't moved in months. <laughs> they may have just got their new they part on their car, honey, and got their car fixed. I don't know. I don't know there's a lot of problems in that junk. I know that. So anyway, y'all. Mm. Mm -hmm. Are y'all planting gardens and things and stuff? Getting stuff in the ground at that time of year. 
Mm-hmm. You know they say April showers bring May flowers. But at that time of year, y'all. For y'all to get on out there and get that stuff in the ground. I hate we can't plant nothing no more. Well, I do. Mm. Or oh, I haven't planted anything. I can say can't, but I haven't planted anything. Mm. Either year that we've been here in Georgia. See what they saw working with. We're gonna plant something next year. Mm-hmm. We're gonna put something in the ground next year. That's so therapeutic. Damn. If you've never had a garden, mm, mm. they say it's the same thing like with a, a flower bed. I don't know about that. I guess it's the same prospect uh, because you're sitting there and you're nourishing something for it to grow, I guess. But uh, in that garden, baby, when you really get through growing, baby, you can take it in there and put it in a skillet. You know what I mean? Or a boil or, or whatever. You know? So... But that is so therapeutic to grow your own food. Um, that is. It's so therapeutic. It is. It's just therapeutic. Mm-hmm. You go out there and you sit with it and you hoe in it and dig in and degrass it. And talk to the Lord and ask the Lord to bless your plants. You know. Mm-hmm. It's so mind soothing. Maybe it really is. Oh, uh, yeah, y'all, we missed the real one's birthday the other day, too. Danielle Washington, happy birthday, boo. Happy birthday to y'all. Happy birthday. Danielle, happy birthday, baby. I'm sorry that we missed it. Y'all, Danielle's birthday was Monday. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. If today is the 20, no, today is the 30th, and it's Wednesday, so her birthday was the 28th. On Monday. Happy birthday, beautiful. Mm hmm. Mm. And then, yeah, I hope your day was filled with love, fun, mm. joy, happiness. And I hope you had lots and lots and lots of gifts. Mm hmm. Mm, mm hmm. Mm. Oh, y'all yeah, getting full. That rotis chicken, baby, we'll knock you off of it now. That rotis. Mm-hmm. Well, say well say that rosary chicken. <laughs> Go get me a rosary. <laughs> say bro, it's a nut <laughs> She calls it rosary chicken, her. Mm-hmm. Anyway, y'all, today has been a lovely day. It's been a great day. It's been a great day. It's actually been an amazing day. It's been an amazing day because it is the day the Lord has made. And I'm glad. Now I'm going to rejoice in it. Like I said, I just had a few summer moments. Um, me and my sister and brother were on Google Duo. And like I said, picked up my father's headstone. Mm. All that kind of stuff. Mm. Mm. So, like I said, that was a, a somber little moment, man. I was saying, um, I think for me, mm. 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 that's good. Um, like I said, I think for me, y'all, believe it or not, it's kind of harder to, um, I guess, I'm not going to say accept, but it's, it kind of feels like it's going to be hard to even go out there and put the gravestone up and than it was at the funeral. I don't know that yet because we hadn't got there, but it would take some while to get it made. But... Mm, mm. The way I feel in my heart, <clears throat> that feels like it's gonna be just as hard. I mean, just thinking about it. 
Um, anyway, I love y'all. I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. I do. I love each and every one of you guys. I have truth to do. I want to reiterate to you guys today. If you still have your parents living, love on them. Kiss on them. Hug on them. Let them know how much you love them and adore, adore them. Mm. Because it is a gift. Having your parents alive on the earth, on walking the same earth that you are, is a gift. That's a gift from God. And all of us are so lucky. And on top of that, all of us didn't know that we were lucky while they were here. And probably didn't really take advantage of the time that we had like we should have. So I'm going to make sure I tell you today that having your parents here walking there alongside you on this side of earth, on this side of life, is a blessing to you. No matter what they're doing, um, it's a blessing to you. If you love them, if you love them now, if you love your parents, no matter what they're doing, forgive them. Forgive them. And enjoy the time that you haven't left with them. You know, um, it don't cost none of us nothing to forgive at all. Um, that way your heart won't have to. Um, because one day, whether you know it or not, even if it's after they're gone, you're going to have to forgive anyway. You're going to have to release that out of your heart regardless. You don't have to. But that kind of stuff can't enter into the gates of heaven. You have to release it one day you're gone. God said you must forgive. So why not today? You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So, if your parents are still here, love on them, y'all. Let them know how much you care about them. Give them their flowers while their eyeballs can still open up and see them. If they ain't got no eyeballs, give them their flowers where you can let their nose smell them and, you know, put their nose on the flower. You know, whatever. Give it to them now. Parents are important to your life. They brought you here. That was God's gateway of getting you here. Um, then you being who you are, just like you are, the person that you are, you couldn't have got here otherwise. <gasps> and uh, I tell people all the time, they say, well, well I wish I had <clears throat> I had another, I had more parents. I had another father. I had another mother. You wouldn't have been you. The only way for you to be who you are, period. I don't care what you say, how you say it, how you say it. The only way for you to be who you are, but you have been created who you are. It took those parents, that daddy and that mama. That's it. That's all. So... You know, that's it, that's all. None of us got to choose uh, who we got. All I'm saying is, no matter who you got, if you love them and you care about them, okay, God to show them why they can, why they're still here and the blood is still running warm in their veins, okay? I love y'all, I love y'all, love you, love you, I love y'all, love you, love, you, love you, and I hope you guys have enjoyed what we do. Sam's brother had me a rosary today, honey. <laughs> Then yeah, happy birthday, baby. Uh, and I hope you guys have enjoyed. To all my newly Jan, thank you guys so, so much for being here. We truly appreciate each and every one of you because you didn't have to be here. You could have chosen to be the rest in the world, but you chose to be right here with us, and we love you for it. Mwah. To all my sister Lee Jan, hey, round and round we go, hey, round and round we go. We love you guys so, so much. And I'm going to see you guys next time, okay? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys will always remember that there's always more than one way home. All you said I to do is get there. So get there, people. Get there. I love you all. And I'm going to see you guys next time. And if you're not going to watch me next time, you have lied to me. And I know you lied. Period. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Woo. When I said, nah, it was a piece of chicken hanging in my mouth. <laughs> it was a piece of chicken hanging in the back of my mouth. Anyway, y'all, we love you. We love you. I'm tired, y'all. I'm ready to get off work. I am ready to get off work. Ooh, y'all, they had a sale on these, um, if you use them. The Febreze uh, Air Pressing. I love the game. Oh, they had a sale on them today in Sam's. You get four bottles of these right here for $6.
Yeah, you got four bottles for six bucks. And Sam's today. We stalked up. Believe that. Anyway, y'all, I love y'all. I love y'all, love you, love you. I love y'all, love y'all, love you. I'm going to see you next time, okay? Bye! Mwah.